it's Lindsay Fly Girl Fitness um, VSG coming into you with my week 180 something uh, post op vertical sleeve gastrectomy. I um, am driving, I'm at a red light, but um, my makeup was on point today. I actually did a tutorial on YouTube. I think I do my makeup pretty good, thanks to Lauren, but um, I sometimes don't always know how to use all the colors in my palette, so I got a little tutorial online today for my Tartlet Amazonian clay matte. No no sparkles today. So anyway, um, I was trying to go for something light and summery, but I really kind of, it's a little heavy handed. That's all right. I also got these. So anyway, um, I'm coming into with my week 180 something post-op. <sighs> just a super quick update. So um, I love just getting into the numbers per usual. I actually didn't weigh myself today, so I'm not entirely sure where I'm at, but I know where I'm at about this week. Ugh, it's not good. It's confusing. So, okay. Um, I, my highest recorded weight is 319 that I know of. Um, excuse me. I weighed in, t um, for the two week pre-op diet at 301.2. I had surgery December 5th, 2013, weighed in 291.8. Yes, 291.8. Um, my lowest post-op, uh, weight was about 18 months post-op at 181.2. My highest regain weight was 229. Um, last week, I don't, uh, I apologize for not um, knowing my numbers for last week. I, I obviously am ill prepared uh, for this conversation, but um, I apologize for that. But anyway, uh, I, I weighed in this week and it was like 225. And I was like, what? But a couple things. My diet hasn't been too bad. It was a little off the rails this weekend. I, I did had some, um, did had some. My grandma's so good. Uh, I did have some unscheduled drinking. Um, and I, but otherwise my food was okay. I was a little off the rails on Monday. Monday was a rough day eating wise. Otherwise, like I, we made, um, roast chicken and I made chimney flanked steak with chimichurri sauce which is you know has I guess high in fat because of the oil but otherwise it's just fruit is fruit herbs fresh herbs and spices and things like that um so good and caprese we feast on caprese um salad so you know basil tomato mozzarella salt a little oil and vinegar um pepper so yeah that was I mean pretty much it and I was I moved a little bit more this weekend. Uh, did plenty of walking on Friday. Um, did some pretty good yard work and pressure washing and stuff like that on Saturday. Um, Sunday was pretty, I ran some errands and was running around. Um, so an update on my knee. Oh, actually another thing I think affected my weight. So I don't know if it's a drinking or if it's that it's got, gotten very hot here um, or we're having some heat. Um, and so I might be retaining water because I'm drinking plenty of water and I don't feel like I'm going to the bathroom that much. Um, so maybe I'm just adjusting to the heat. I don't, I don't know. Um, also, uh, I have had my period like three times this month, like not set, like maybe since the end of May. So definitely in the last like four or five weeks I've spotted or had like a full day so I wouldn't say I've had my period but I've been having some things it's not typical with someone with an IUD which I have so I don't know what that's all about so um, I'm, I'm sure that that's affecting me in some way as well from a weight perspective um, an update on my knee I know I talked to you guys last about this last week um, hold on, sorry I got something in my eyeball oh Uh, so I got my MRI last Wednesday. I got my results last Thursday. Um, I sprint, you know, I, we already knew I sprained my ankle. My ankle feels actually super great. I've been taking it. Oh, by the way, my purple hair is still pretty, isn't it? Um, I did not tear my meniscus, but I also did not bruise the bone, meaning that that was the best and worst, worst and best case scenario. Um, but I actually am in between. So I actually sprained my MCL, which is your medial. So anyway, it's the kind of this thing that it goes on the inside, kind of where your, um, 
hamstring meets the inside kind of your of your knee. So I spray I like sprained or strained that. So no tear, no surgery, but rest. So I did not officially start my eight week challenge on Monday as scheduled because of my knee pain. Um, and I'm just giving it another time. So I then so I didn't do anything last week and I thought to not start it again this week um just due to um you know the exercise plan and giving it another kind of like 10 to 14 10 days or so from the time I got my MRI results to like really let it heal and it's still smarting it's it definitely still hurts um but it, it it's good days and bad days but the good, good days are more than the bad days so I feel like that's all good news um, I was cleared by my, not my doctor, but I go to a chiropractor still for the car accident I was in and I was kind of just talking to him about it and he said I should definitely, you know, start walking and I'm cleared to that, to do that sort of thing. So I'll, um, my game plan is to start on Monday, um, with walking and, um, getting back into the gym for weights because there's really nothing I can, that I should be doing that should affect my weightlifting. So, but it's been like a solid two months since I've been in the gym. So, um, it's going to probably be a slow, slow week, but it's okay. As long as I get in there, um, that's what I feel good about. So we'll see how that goes. Um, I'm feeling positive. I don't want anybody commenting on my yawning. So I'll always cover my mouth now. Ugh, creepy. Um, what else? So yeah, starting on Monday, I'm two weeks delayed, but it is what it is. I also joined Melissa's or Melly May on YouTube. I joined her diabet. Like I didn't even watch her video before I joined. I, I watched her video, but I watched it after I joined. I saw she was doing it. I was thinking about doing one too, uh, but I didn't really get any response about interest. So I just joined hers, which is fine with me. Um, what else? So yeah, I'm confused about my weight going up as much as it has um, because I was down from Mexico and um, I definitely have been a little discouraged this week with that whole MCL sprain and not being able to start when I wanted to and uh, this week has definitely been a little bit um, rougher from an eating perspective than the week prior. So I'm just going to have